सो नाउ लेट्स नो ए लिटिल बिट मोर अबाउट दीज माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम विच आर सो इम्पॉर्टेंट सो द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट वन विल बी फंगे एंड देन देर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ फंगे द फर्स्ट वन इज सैप्रोफाइट्स सो दीज आर लाइक प्राइमरी डिकम्पोजर्स इफ यू सी ए फॉलन लॉग समवेयर डिकम्पोजिंग लॉग यू विल सी ट्री फंगे ऑन दट दिस दिस विल बी हार्ड अनलाइक योर मशरूम्स विच विच वी सॉफ्ट सो दीज आर द प्राइमरी डिकम्पोजर्स एंड देन कैन कम द माइक्रोराइजा सो माइक्रोराइजा द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट फंगे वेन इट कम्स टू प्लांट्स विदाउट फंगे विदाउट माइक्रोराइजा प्लांट लाइफ वुडेंट प्लांट्स वुडेंट हैव टेकन ओवर द वर्ल्ड लाइक दिस सो वॉट माइक्रोराइजा डज इज दे फॉर्म फंगल नेटवर्क इन द सॉइल एंड दे स्टार्ट एसोसिएटिंग विद द roots the roots of uh, plant they synthesize certain uh, chemicals to attract this fungi and they form a mutual relationship symbiotic relationship so what do they get in return the fungi what they do is they work on soiled minerals and they make it bioavailable let's say phosphate they make uh, bioavailable phosphate and supply it to the feed it to the trees and what do they get in return what are trees good at trees are good at making uh, carbohydrates they take sunlight they take carbon and water and uh, they make glucose and this glucose they give it to the they feed it to the uh, fungal networks and they get nutrients in return so these fungal networks they get destroyed when you start tilling your soils more and more even in orchard crops also when you till in between these fungal networks gets destroyed if you go to a forest nobody is tilling its soil so there are vast networks of fungi over there mycorrhiza over there and uh, let's say there is a drought in a forest for 3 uh, or 4 years some trees they may shed some leaves they may get a little bit uh, shriveled up but they don't die off completely it's because mycorrhiza it's getting water from the water table and supplying it to the these trees and keeping them alive the same doesn't happen in your farms because you have destroyed all the fungal networks so you should always take care to not to till too deep so uh, when it comes to uh, decomposition in your farm because you are disturbing the compost heap the complete carbon cycle doesn't happen because you are stopping it at the actinomycete stage you think the decomposition is done and you are uh, removing the compost pile and you are applying it to the uh, trees but in the forest the comp- complete decomposition cycle the carbon cycle takes place so uh, if you stop disturbing your soil the complete decomposition will take place so fungi is very important here so when you pick up a uh, clump of soil in a forest you will see certain uh, white thread like substances in there fluffy fluffy thread like uh, things in there that's the fungal network it's called it's the hyphae of the fungi so it's not just nutrients which uh, the fungi supplies plants actually talk to each other they pass on messages when they are in stress they also pass on nutrients one plant supplies nutrients to the other plant so this they do basically through fungal networks so let's say one plant in a forest it's getting attacked by certain pest and uh, one thing it can do is it can start making its leaves bitter it can pump up some pump up production of some uh, chemicals and makes it make its uh, leaves bitter so so to repel this pest so it does that but along with that it passes this message about the pest attack to other trees in the surrounding and by the time this pest goes and sits on its companion by the time those trees would have already pumped up this pest repelling uh, chemicals the same thing doesn't happen in your orchard let's say there is a aphid attack on one of your uh, mango trees the message doesn't get uh, transmitted to another mango tree because we till the soil in our orchard if we don't do that 
our trees will become more resistant they will be more they will they will be able to pass on these messages about uh, certain pest to their neighbors so that they are better prepared to take on this pest so soil uh, fungi these fungi they are not just limited to soil so if you go to your farms early in the morning when the dew is still there you can see some of the leaves they will be all shiny and sometimes you will even see small thread like very fine finer than spiders webs uh, sort of threads on these leaves so that's basically fungi covering the plant and protecting it, it from pathogens the air it's full of lot of microbes viruses bacteria pathogenic bacteria etc so this covering of fungi it's basically protecting the tree from these airborne pathogens and why does the fungi do that if the plant thrives that means the fungi also thrives it also gets more area to replicate and increase its own population so fungi is very beneficial to your soil if you don't have beneficial fungi you can always the the uh, fungi cultures are available and you can always spray them on your uh, orchards and uh, recreate this fungal population again